you saw this. Where's my controller? Skip. Okay, so this is the Ninja Warriors. And we are going to play it on hard mode because it's easy even on hard mode. In the Ninja Warriors, you got your choice of three characters here. There's Ninja, standing nearly seven feet tall and weighing three quarters of a ton. Kunoi Chi, standing five foot six and weighing 143 pounds. And Kamaitachi, standing six feet tall, weighing 220 pounds. If I ever show you Kamaitachi and Ninja, the man's like, what, 10 inches taller and weighs 1,300 extra pounds? Oh well, we're going to play with Kunoi Chi, because she's the balanced character. Ninja, huge, strong, and slow. Kamaitachi is very quick. Actually, I'd probably say Kamaitachi is the balanced character. He's very quick, and he's got good attacks. These are our basic attacks, two Kuni daggers. You can jump, jump kick, bam. We're fighting grunts, and they're equal opportunity employers, as you can see. The straight jump attack is a sword. Whoa. We've got ducking attacks. Now, if you duck and hit jump, you stab the crap out of people. Alright, this is blocking. When you block, you are invincible. Unless they attack your feet. But we have throws. That's the up throw. That's another up throw. You can throw motorcycles at people. Great pastime. Alright, come over here. Here's the... Alright, my D-pad sucks and it keeps thinking I'm throwing up. No. No. There's a straight throw. And here's the down throw, which is actually my favorite. The nut punch. I first started playing this game when I was in elementary school, and that has always been my favorite part of this entire game, is the nut punch. Two punches to the nuts is all it takes to kill one of these guys. Ow! Alright, when I said that I was good at, that this game was easy even on hard mode, I also assumed that I had played the game recently. Last time I played this game was about three years ago. During spring break in my final year of college, we had... Oh, I sat down and I just played all kinds of old Nintendo games. That move right there... You see this meter at the bottom that builds up over time. Oh, ow, that hurt. If you do a... F uh, normally... You do one, two, three, four, and then she hits them with a sword. If you hold up when they're doing that... No, don't, no. Aw, oh, man, I'm going to jump real high. It'll do a special move using your weapon. Otherwise, and I'll show you this real soon, it will blow up like this, hitting everybody on screen. But then the meter has to go up from the bottom. If you use just your regular special from the combo, the meter doesn't need to go all the way down and you can start filling it from the bottom. Oh. And if someone shoots you in the foot with a high-powered rifle, you fall down. You're gonna get blown up. Oh no. Ow. Oh, I should mention, part of the reason I suck at this game right now is because... I like to win with style. It's not cool enough to just hit a guy and kill him, because I could just walk through the game and do that. I like it to look cool. Alright, so here's the first boss. He's basically Arnold Schwarzenegger on steroids. Looks like a bad 80s villain. 
Ow, boot to the face. No! Get over here. There we go. Now we're in good territory. Bam. I like to use that sword slash against the boss because... Dang it. Because then I get to lose all my energy like that. Alright, no more Mr. Nice Guy. I'm gonna blow up because I died. That is a very poor way to start this. Game over on my first recording. Oh, man. I used to have a rule where if I died with someone, I had to use someone else. Because the other robot exploded and was no longer available. As you saw in the intro video, Mulk is gone. Okay, there's a problem here. There's a problem here. No. No. Okay, give me just a sec here. All right. There we go. Something was stuck on my controller. All right, so you can see he's got some speed to him. He's got these wicked scythe blades on his uh, arms. That's his down B move. Whereas Kunoichi stabs, this guy delivers one hell of a sidekick. Now he has a really cool move. You just jump straight up and you turn into a whirling disc of death. And you keep getting blown up because you're not paying attention to your feet. Always a good, good move. Now one thing I didn't like about Kamitachi is one, he's terrible at throws. And I like to throw enemies. The other thing I don't like about him is he's the only character in the game that can hit the one-hit kills guys and not kill them. Watch, that green guy will get back up. Both of them will. His punch on the when you're ducking is a double punch. And unfortunately, unless both of them hit, it only counts as half a hit. And if they're on the ground, that means that that half a hit will knock them prone, but it won't kill them. Maybe I'll do it this time. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Now we're going to use his special move without... All of them have the blow-up move that I showed you that hit all the enemies on screen. But then each one has its own cool move. Kcha! Oh, I didn't jump far enough. One of the moves I like to use is I jump out of the way and then kick the crap out of things. Boom! Ow. Boom! Ow. Alright. No points for style. We're gonna beat him with the kick. Oh, come on, you monkey. Boom! There we go. Like I said, when I suck at this game, it's because I'm trying to do something cool. Oh, good, he's on screen enough. He blows up, he blows up again, and then he just sort of stands there for all time. All right, we're going to cut off here at level 2, and I will see you again in a minute.